Hey y'all, it's Brady. Welcome to my channel. Thank you so much for joining me. And today we have got a Bath and Body Works haul. Let's get into it. Okay, so I've got my big bag off to the side here. My kids are home because hello, summer break. And I'm filming in my room and they are next to me. Well, sort of next to me in the house here. So if you hear them in the background, well, it is what it is. <laughs> Sorry about that. Uh, so let me grab my receipt. Let me throw candles around apparently also. All right, so it says total discount, $135.66. Um, I did shop the semi-annual sale and I also had a 20% off coupon. They had a couple of things um, on sale that I wanted to grab, so went to our local store. I also had $38 in rebate cash um, that I was able to cash into a Bath & Body Works digital gift card from Ibotta. So I took that with me. Um, and I also was going to use Fetch. I just didn't do it in time because it does take a couple hours there for theirs to process. If you have, if you buy groceries, <laughs> um, or really anything of these days, I'm going to link down below for you Ibotta, Fetch Rewards, Rakuten, all those good money saving things that you can use for fun purchases or whatever, turn them around and use them again on groceries or gas. Um, they're really, really easy rebates to use. Rakuten I use anytime I'm online because pretty much any store has at least some percentage. Even when you book travel, all of it. Um, it really comes in handy when I'm buying like Christmas presents and birthday presents because I just, you know, hit the little button and it takes on and it'll give me a few percent back and that's all I had to do. And then once a quarter, Rakuten either sends me a PayPal deposit or a check. It's easy. Um, it really is that easy. And so anyways, that's part of, that's a big part of what I use. So I had $38 there and then I did, I think I used $35 just out of our discretionary spending, um, to get like $200 worth of product. Now I will say that two of the things that I bought were, um, one of the little antibacterial hand sanitizers and one of the holders for that, that you like wrap around a clip on your bag, you know. Um, I paid $1.50 for the thing, but then 20% off. So how much was it? $1.20. And then after the sale and the 20% off on the little antibacterial uh, hand sanitizer, that one ended up being 78 cents. So I'm telling you that because they are not here. Um, they're on my husband's lunchbox at work. So anyway, what did I get? So I got the hand sanitizer. I got the holder for the hand sanitizer for a bag. I got three of the single wick candles and six, yeah, six of the three wick candles. So, um, after my rebate from, uh, rebate gift card from Ibotta, after my 20% off coupon and including, uh, 9.75% sales tax in the state of Tennessee, I paid, uh, $35.51 just out of our discretionary spending. So, this is one of those times that I talk about that Ibotta and Fetch and all these things really come in handy because I would not have spent almost $80 um, in the store just of our own spending money uh, just for candles and stuff, but it ended up being a really good deal. So, okay. So, um, for most of the candles, so let me start with the first candle because if they would have had more of these, I would have definitely gotten it because it was a fall candle. And so um, with a semi-annual sale, you know, they just kind of throw whatever they've got left. So this one is the Spiced Apple Toddy. Um, and the notes in this one are warm am apple brandy, spiced plum, tart cranberry, cinnamon stick with natural essential oils. And it is one of the three wicks. 
Y'all, it smells phenomenal. What is that store? The Apple Barn. Um, if you've ever been to like Gatlinburg, Pigeon Forge, Sevierville, and you go into something like the Apple Barn up there or the Christmas store, um, this is smells just like that to me. Just apples and cinnamon with a little bit of, you can definitely smell the cranberry and plum. This is so good. And y'all will not believe this. This was 75% off um, as part of their sale. So I literally paid, yeah, it was 75% off. So after the 75% off and the, this is normally a $25.50 candle and they're going up like everything else. But after that 20% off and the 75% off sale that it was already on, I paid $5.10. Most of the three wick candles this size at Walmart that I'm sorry, but they just don't throw the same way. They don't last the same way. Um, they're $5 at least. So to me, that's amazing. If they would have had more at that 75% off or just more of this scent in particular, I would have gotten them, but they didn't. And I wonder why, because that's a phenomenal deal. <laughs> Okay, the rest of these were on sale for $11.99 and then I had a 20% off coupon. So the rest of the three wick candles I paid $9.56 for. So let's just go down the line here. So this one is another white bar barn candle and it is the coconut and vetiver. And it says coconut milk, wild jasmine and vetiver, not vetiver, vetiver. It just smells clean. So it definitely kind of smells coconutty. And you can, you get the kind of um, tanning lotion, but it's not, it's not like most of them that you see. It's, it's very subtle. It's very subtle. Y'all, it's, in, it smells incredible. It's very clean smelling. I really, really enjoy that one too. So that one was $9.56. This one, we have already burnt this one. So when I show it to you in a moment, um, you'll see what I mean. But we have already been burning this one. The throw is amazing. I've never heard of this one. They've never had this one before, at least not at my stores. And um, it is so good. I am kicking myself for not getting more of them. And honestly, when I have more rebate cash to cash out before the semi-annual sale is over, I'm probably going to try to find a few more of these because they are that good. Uh, so this is the vanilla and peach tea candle. And it says peach tea, sweet vanilla cream, fresh oat milk. <sighs> Y'all. It just, it smells like a glass of peach tea. It is so good. It is so, so good. And again, $9.56. But again, keep in mind that even with that price, that's not factoring in that gift card that I had. So I paid even less for these. Okay, the next one is the Hot Fudge Drizzle. And it says rich it, rich it. It says rich melted chocolate, vanilla bean, and a dash of brown sugar. It smells like a jar of Hershey's syrup or a, or a jar of hot, hot fudge. Um, with a, it, it smells exactly like, <laughs> exactly what it says. So it smells exactly like getting a hot fudge sundae with vanilla ice cream. That's exactly what this smells like. I think that is so wild. Um, and again, these are normally $24.50. But the new candles that they will put out for the fall that are not included in the sale will be more than that. Guarantee it. I wouldn't be surprised if we see $27. Um, that one is really, really good. We have not burnt that one yet. We have not burned any of these except for the peach tea. Um, okay, so then the next one, I thought this was really pretty and not all of these I thought pretty much other than this hot fudge drizzle um, I think they did a really good job of them not necessarily looking super, um, summery. So they smell, a lot of them are summer scents, but they're not all, you know, like you're just going to see 
you know, whatever. They're not just like all lemons and sunshine and, uh, you know, boating or something like that. Okay, so this one was originally $25.50. This is the Watermelon Lemonade, and I paid $9.56 for it. This one says Watermelon Ice, Sparkling Water, and Meyer Lemon. Yep, just like I remember it. Um, we've had multiple of these. I try to snag one or two every semi-annual sale because they are that good. It's just a really refreshing um, watermelon and lemon smell. It smells pretty clean. Um, the watermelon is not too sweet because um, a lot of those super sweet candles give me a really bad headache. Okay, and then this last three wick, I believe, yeah, is the White Barn Champagne Margarita. And I've never seen this one before either. So I think this was new this summer. I'm not sure, but it's a normally $26.50. I paid $9.56. Um, and then, you know, less than that after that gift card. So anyways, freshly squeezed lime, bubbly champagne, and sugar cane crystals. It smells really, really good too. It's just super citrusy. Um, it doesn't have like an alcohol scent of a margarita. It's it's literally the lime. And um, there's almost like a, almost like an orange scent too. It's just very citrusy. I don't get an overly sweet smell from them mentioning the sugar cane crystal scent in there um, in the notes, but it's definitely fruity, citrusy. We really like it. Um, so we'll see how that one burns because I've never had that one before either. Okay, now moving on to the single wicks I got. And I will keep watching this sale and I may get a few more things. So if I do, then I'll share with them in another video. Uh, but these, let me check my receipt. So these are normally $15.50, which is ridiculous. I would never, ever, ever pay that. Um, and what did I get these for? Okay, so I don't know why, but one of them, this first one I'll start with, I really don't know why or what the difference is, um, but this one, I guess was 75% off. Let's see if it tells me. I don't think it tells me. Funny enough, it's, yeah, so these are 75% off, and I think it's because these are the do not sell. These are like the the scented things, the candles that are sitting there for you to smell when you buy like the wallflowers and stuff. That's why it's a very plain packaging. All right, but, so my battery died, had to charge that, but we're back. Hopefully it will last long enough to finish up this semi-annual sale haul. So anyways, so this is one of the displays. I love this scent. Mm -hmm. Honeycrisp apple, it is fabulous. Like I said, this says normally $14.50, but I did not pay that. What did I tell y'all I paid? Yeah, $2.89. So I would have gotten more of these if they would have had them. Um, yep, and this doesn't have the notes on it, um, but it's literally Honeycrisp apple. It is what it says. It just smells super clean. I will probably save this one until closer to fall because what I'll do is I'll bring this one in our bedroom and the larger um, apple toddy one in the um, like great room main area of the house and it'll complement well throughout the house, okay? Um, then I got um, another one of the small single wick candles. Um, these were on sale for $5.95 and then as part of the semi-annual sale and then I had 20% off so I paid 476 for this one and this one um and these were very limited or I would have gotten a few more of these as well it says the fragrance notes on this iced lemon pound cake I don't know if you're going to be able to see without the glare um but the notes are sugary glazed icing pure lemon zest and fluffy pound cake it is very sweet, very, 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 very sweet. Um, you definitely get the cake scent, but it also definitely has a nice refreshing lemon scent. 
and I like it. We'll see how it burns. I think if it was one of the three wicks, it would be way too overpowering, but I think it's going to be a nice complement in our bedroom to one of the other ones, um, or even in a bathroom or something like that. We'll see where we put it, um, but yeah. Now, Midnight Blue Citrus. This is the other single wick that I got. And I have actually had many of these in the three wicks. They are amazing. They are white barn candles from Bath and Body Works. Again, this one was normally $14.50 on sale for $5.95, 20% off, made it $4.86. And the notes, I don't think the notes are on this one either. Mm -mm. I don't see the notes on this one. So, um, this one to me smells like, the best way I know how to put this is if you walk into like a fancy um, home store, that's what it smells like to me. So, there's a lot of the citrus notes, lemon, orange, maybe some lime in there. But there's something else and I don't remember what it is that's in there. It's not vanilla, um, but there, and it's not super like sugary sweet either, but there's definitely something to this um, more than just the citrus um, that you're getting is like an undertone. And I love it. I love it. Um, they did not have any of the three wicks in this or I would have gotten it. Um, we, I have hauled many, many, many of the three wicks of this. They're just really good. Um, they clean your house and then light one of those, uh, Midnight Blue Citrus. Mm -hmm. Your whole house is gonna smell fabulous. Um, and it's just, it's like super calming while also being a nice refreshing scent as well, if that makes any sense at all. So like I said, $135.66 total discount. Let me see if I can get that to show. Let's see if I can get that to show you there. But. The total discount there, $135.66. Subtotal after the sale for the semi-annual sale on all of those and my 20% off was $67.29, $6.56 in Tennessee state tax for sales tax. And then, the, so that made the total $73.85. I had a gift card again from my Ibotta rebates, $38.34. I paid $35.51 out of pocket. Again, I got six of the giant three wick candles that are normally $25, $26 each, and three of the single wick candles that are normally $14 to $15 each. And then, like I said, one of the small hand sanitizers and the little loop-de-loop -loop thing that holds it to go on my husband's lunchbox. So, not a bad deal. I don't, I don't think we did too bad. So, um, again, I'll be watching on the website and in my local store for a couple more things as they add more to the 75% off section of the semi-annual sale. Check out your local Bath and Body Works. They're going to have different things than what online has. I mean, there's going to be some similarities, but, um, yeah. And I am signed up for their emails. That's where I got the 20% off coupon, but they do routinely, um, mail out coupons if you're signed up for that too. So, um... You know, I am to the point where I really, really enjoy Bath and Body Works candles and their hand soaps, but I will not, <laughs> will not pay almost $30 for one candle. It's, I'm just not going to do it. Um, and even at 50% off, you're talking $13, $14 now, which is okay. I mean, it's better, but it's still a lot so when I see them on sale for a similar price like this during the semi-annual sale, as I can get when they're in the, you know, like the Walmart candles or the Aldi candles, and y'all have seen me buy them if you've been here for a while. You've definitely seen me buy Walmart and um, Aldi candles and they're, they're okay. They're just not the same caliber to me, in my opinion. Um, and so I really like to watch for these sales, use my rebate cash, and buy something, you know, extra that's fun that we enjoy with it. And yeah, that's kind of my thing there. I think that's everything. Yep. Okay. So six three wick candles, three single wick candles, hand sanitizer, and 
only in a holder for the hand sanitizer cost me $35. So I think that's a pretty good deal. Check out yours. If you've been to Bath and Body Works for this semi-annual sale, let me know down in the comments down below what you purchased. If you prefer to get your candles elsewhere, I'd love to know what you like to get there. They did have the hand soaps um, included, but I didn't get any because we're still well stocked on those. So that's everything I've got for y'all. If you're new here and you've somehow made it this far, thank you so much for joining us. And I hope that you will um, introduce yourself in the comments down below and um, hit that subscribe button and stick around. So that's everything I've got for y'all. Until our next video, y'all, I will see you in the comments down below. Bye.